Ted here. <laughs> Ow. Stop it, hand. Bad finger. Oh. All right. How y'all doing today? <laughs> I'm losing it. Oh, wait. I never had to begin with. All right, everybody. Um, how you doing out there in the fog brains land? Uh, the world of brains and fog. Hope y'all good. That's like really bright. Sorry about that. That's like, ooh. Right there. That's a little better. Now... You might notice something a little different. I lost the beard. I try. I got a little relaxed with the gummy, and I wanted to trim it down a bit, and then it got cut uneven, and then it was uneven again. I was like, oh, go. I turned 50. But me and Thomas both turned 50 recently. We're old. But I figured this start over. We're growing a beard back again. He's growing his, and I'm growing mine. We're going to grow the beard back again, get it big, long, and ooh, ooh, diddly boo. But our cats. <laughs> um, we're gonna grow back. Why is that glass so damn Oh my gosh. So, but it's gonna take a while. So, we have a little bit of a shaving face for the most part, you know. We'll start over and get the beard grown again. Make a big long doo 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 doo. What that means, I have no clue. <laughs> Alright, so today's gonna be a really quick video. Um, Some of us want to try, even though I shouldn't. Slap me in the hand for that one. I usually don't drink these at all. I haven't had an actual one in a long time. But I figured I'm going to give this a shot. I am a Coke drinker. Have them for years. Love my Coca-Cola. You know, not the best thing for you to have too often. Um, probably the reason I'm a diabetic. Because <laughs> I used to drink it at copious amounts when I was younger. But, you know what? Let's give it a shot. Because... I drink one a little bit once a year. Christmas, I'll have some. Actual Coca-Cola. I've done Coke Zero. But everybody was talking about this. I heard this one, and I figured, let's give this a shot. And what is it called? Dark Blend Coca-Cola with Coffee. So, let's give it a shot with the numbers. Let's take a look at what we've got in here. It's actually so really oh interesting 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 all right there's caffeine in it we know it ain't much it's actually not a lot of sugar in this that's not too bad but um yeah we're gonna give it a shot it's gonna be a short one but i wanted to give this a try give it see what see 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 what it tastes like like i said i really won't be drinking this because i don't try to drink coke too much but Sorry, a little doubt in the eye. Sometimes that happens. Little doubts appear. Welcome to diabetes. That's why I really shouldn't be doing any of these. But, you know, I, 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 what I do, guys, for you, I'm pretty good. But let's give this a shot. I'm actually in cutting back on junk food and stuff. I'm going to be doing videos. This is a little snack pack I've decided to put together. Check this out. We have lots of walnuts. And we also, in the bottom, almonds. Mm -mm -mm. I love them both. Walnuts, almonds. Mm. Tastes so good. I was told, you know, you get 420, instead of going to snack on junk food, put together these in the fridge. And then you need a snack, boom, pull it out. There you go. It's healthy. But, I say that in the boat drink this, but like I said, this is something I'm not going to drink. It's the first time I've ever had an actual Coke this year, I think, maybe. Coke Zero don't count. Even though I'm going to be cutting back on that, too. I'm going to be cutting back on all pop, because there's still chemicals in there. I'm just going to be sticking to the green tea and the water. I dare buy. So, we'll see. But for now, we're going to give this a shot, though. Cheers. Ooh. You can really smell the coffee. Ooh, that's strong. Down the hitch.
don't really taste coke but it tastes beans you know what it reminds me of it's not a unique taste it tastes a lot like chocolate covered coffee beans I haven't had them in a long time but I used to like them a girl I knew years ago she introduced me to them and it's just coffee beans wrapped in chocolate they're actually really good um that's another thing I shouldn't be eating too much of. I haven't had them in years, but that's what it reminds me of. Chocolate covered chocolate beans. Coffee beans. Oh, which are really good. But that's exactly what this tastes like. Yep. Pretty much. Maybe the Coke has a, like a chocolate reaction type thing, but it does taste like the chocolate covered coffee beans. So who knew? That's a strange one. Well, confusing a little bit, but it's good. I like it. I really like it. Oh my gosh. That was really good. But it's really confusing. It's, yeah, it's like a chocolate. You don't really taste the coconut dairy. But no, no, no. I'm getting old things. <laughs> blank disc. Who has blank disc anymore? <laughs> I believe in physical media still. <laughs> Digital media is still a I I'm not going to break that right now. But yeah. Mm. I'll give it a thumb up. I won't buy it again because again, I shouldn't be eating. I'm going to be changing my whole diet here thing here soon. But they're not bad. It tastes like chocolate covered coffee beans. That's exactly what it tastes like. So if you ever had chocolate covered coffee beans, you might like this drink. Um, I'll finish it, of course, but I won't buy another one. But I did it for you guys on the channel. Now, again, I'm going to be changing up. By the time you see this, might be the end of the month of October because I got a bunch of other videos coming ahead of this. By then, I would have had a whole month of eating healthy because October is going to be healthy month. And I'm going to change my whole living up just better healthy living. i got to be healthier. Hitting the workouts, less sugar, less chut, all that. Like I said, we've seen the dietitian, me and Thomas both, and the dietitian said, as long as you're eating 80% good, 20% enjoy yourself. And even then, I'm going to lessen those numbers even more. Maybe 10%. Maybe I have one takeout meal a month. Or one little side meal, but generally stick to my my, my my hamburger, or no, not my hamburger, but my meats, meats and veggies, that's the usual plates, and portion it down a little bit, and just overall better heating. And if you're going to have snacks, stuff like this. And I, I'll bench you when I can get more money, I'll add to the snacks. Oh, this one's good. To my walnuts and almonds, I'll add, it's called the Earth Blend Trail Mix. It, uh, no frills. And it has like seeds, uh, pumpkin seeds, it has tumbleweed seeds, and a few other different things in it, which is really good. I can add it to there, and then it become a real good mix then. So, but we'll give it a shot. Again, I'll, I'm going to show you a little healthy snacks here soon. Because i got to get healthier, Tom's got to get healthier, and we're all going to take care of ourselves. But that means it, like I said, it's not bad. It's not bad. Chocolate covered cover beans. That's what it tastes like. So if you like that flavor, give that a shot. That's not bad. And also, if you want to get healthier, little smart thing that I was taught just this week is pre-make snack bowls like this. I got a bunch of these. I got like 20 of them. It came in a pack. And I put about six of them in the fridge. All full. Keep them in the fridge, stacked. And then it's like if you're a little chill or no yummy, like you don't feel like eating bad stuff, there you grab it out of the fridge. Ooh. I pre-make these. See, like I said, I just put the walnuts and almonds in. You don't have to worry, they're all already made. So, that being said, again, this is going to be a quick one. I wasn't going to make this too long. Just quick enough to try this and give it a go. But I do appreciate you people. By the time you see this, I'm, I don't know if Thomas will advance the contest or not. He's getting close to being eliminated. Mm -hmm. But, for that being said, he's going to try to get a grant. Maybe a loan. And further career, because he does need to get a couple new cameras. He needs to get the Sony ZV-E10 that I get to use. Because this one's good. This is a Sony. Which one is the butt? Let's see. Let's see. This is the Sony. Hey, yeah, you can't see. <laughs> Give me a second. This is the Handicam. A Sony Handicam. Um, 9.2 megapixel. Ooh. So it's not a bad camera. But it's starting to lose focus. It doesn't track focus quite good. You know? So, yeah, it kind of loses focus a little bit. So, hopefully the Sony ZV-10, we can use that. It's one of the better ones there for YouTube. We get a good wide-angle lens. And 
it'll help my career. And Thomas, he wants to get the 90D Canon. It's not mirrorless yet. He can't afford those mirrorless because he'd have to get all new lenses and stuff. But the lenses he has now for his cameras, see, he's got this one here. This is the, uh, I mean, that's the T3. It's not a T3i or anything, but still T3. It's what he uses now for taking pictures. And then he has this. What's the lenses on here right now? That is the 24 millimeter. So, that's not a bad little camera. Or lens. I like the low profile, too. But he's looking to get the 90D because these lenses work on that as well. He doesn't have to buy new lenses. So, they work. And then he needs a new computer. Preferably a new computer and a tablet or a laptop. And then he can travel, one, better for editing here on this thing, and also editing on the go. And eventually he also wants to get an iMac from doing music and stuff, but that's it. That's down the road when he has a business and stuff. He had a little office. He'd have a little iMac where he can edit his music. Because, if, by the way, the music you hear, the opening themes here, and everything you hear for, is done by him. That way he doesn't have to worry about copyright music. It's all done by him. All right, everybody. You guys are awesome. Again, don't forget, cold, cold coffee. I'm no fan. I don't mind it, but it tastes good. But I, I don't tell one. I shouldn't be eating, drinking this. I don't believe me. Because I got a little bit and I got a damn sugar. But also, yeah, to be honest, yeah, it's not my favorite. But it's good. I'll give it a th one thumbs up. I'll give it one thumbs up. And if you like chocolate covered coffee beans, you will like that. With that being said, you guys are awesome. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and share. To help build this channel. Let's get this up. I've been doing it seven years now. Me and Thomas both. And I think it's time for us to take off. Share it with Kevin Smith. Share it with Willie Nelson. Share it with Snoop Dogg. Share it with, who else has we got? Uh, Thomas Chong. There's four legends in the 420 community. Share it with them. Maybe they can expand it to a monster channel. We get millions of viewers and I can make money off it. And entertain you guys also. And you need to be able to afford to get healthier because it's expensive. Woo. Like staying healthy is not easy. That's why diabetes is kind of a fight when you're poor. But I'm not giving up. I believe in it. And Tom believes in himself as a photographer. And I believe in myself as a content creator. Let's do this. With that being said, I'm out of here, guys. And oh my gosh. I think this blew my mind of average because I thought it was going to be, oh, but it was, eh, but it was good. One thumb. But I forgot one thing. I think it's the beard. It's, it, I don't have my beard anymore. But I'm, even without the beard, I'm still cute. All right, everybody. You guys are awesome. I do love this. And I will talk to you later. Peace. Mm, I don't get to the tongue. I just look at my lovely face. Ooh. Ah. Mm, peace sounds out there. It's like, out of shot, man. Get on there. <gasps> Ooh, look at that. Look at that. <gasps> Twelve seconds later. I totally forgot before I said it. I forgot to sign off. And Thomas in the background, he yelled at me. He said, you didn't sign off. Oh, I better sign off. Hit the button. Hit the button. The button. Ah. I'm in trouble for that one.